Okay, we're gonna do a night hunt tonight. Uh, it's me and Jordan, and here's my first target. It's about one o'clock in the morning right now. It's actually a cold night, I mean, for California. Not that cold. But if it'll ever let me dig here, I'll dig this quarter. Should be a quarter. Oh, there was another guy down here. He got a nice gold ring. I'm not going to say what beach I'm at. And I didn't get it. Darn. It's not quite low tide yet, so it's kind of waiting for it to go down. Yikes. Uh. <laughs> oh my gosh. I had it. I know I did. It's gone now. Just got washed out. Anyways. <laughs> there was a coin coin here. There it is. <laughs> I wa actually walked out to find it. It's still going down. Ugh. Now it's going to be really hard to get because I'm in knee deep water. Uh, it's sucking out hard. Sometimes it's good if you could just get a scoop on it, and we'll go down in that hole. You know what? I know this is just a quarter. I don't think I'm gonna chase it. I'm gonna end up getting plowed by one of these waves. So anyways, we're on the coins, I just haven't gotten yet. I got a pair of sunglasses. Jordan eyeballed them. It's like an 18, 16. We'll take it. Take anything we can get right now. <laughs> anything. Now it's a 20, so it could be a penny. And it should be in the scoop, hopefully. Yeah, it should be a penny. And there she is. First coin of the night. It's like a 12. Oh, so there's a nine in there also. Let's see what the 12 was. Looks like a little piece of copper wire or something. Not sure. There's a nine ten. See what this is. Probably more of that copper wire. Well, it's too small to get in the scoop. Or maybe it was in the scoop. Great. <laughs> I don't hear nothing now. Let's just throw it down. Sometimes it'll stick to the scoop, whatever it is. Well, 
Yeah, it was another piece of that wire. Or whatever it is. I don't know. Let's keep going. That should be a nickel. Really not getting very many signals. I'm going over. <laughs> A spot that a guy with a 15 inch coil went over already. Except the tide's a little lower now. So it pays to do it. A nickel. I guess, I don't know. Probably one of the newer ones. I don't know what that is actually. Looks like a nickel. Okay. Here's a dime, or, oh, it could be a penny. 23. Now it's 25. Should be a dime. Let's toss it up here. See if we can shake it out. Oh no, it is actually a penny. Ooh 1975. Look at that thing, it's clean. <laughs> oh, I still have them in the same spot. There's 29 right there. 30. Let's just take that one. This might just be one big target. Oh, that's deep. Alright, let's see what it is. It definitely ran up as a quarter. When I see it, it is a quarter. Alright. There's a quarter. Now we're getting some action. This should be another quarter. That's a rock. And that's a quarter. All right, that's two quarters right in a row there. Let's keep going. Well, I was just out in the water and I dug this thing. Not sure what in the world it is, but it's obviously a big piece of metal. There's a little piece of metal like stuck to it right there. And a whole bunch of rocks. Anyways, we'll keep going. I'll throw that up there for now. All right, I see a circle in my scoop, so I turned on my camera, but it was ringing up 18. So it's probably a junker but it is a ring but we'll find out when we get home I don't know pretty easy to tell it's a junker though look at but I think I see writing in there <laughs> I don't know we'll have to check it when we get home awesome I'm just happy to find a ring tonight Keep going. Whew. 
Well, I've been digging a lot of quarters, and I just got my first bottle cap. So, kind of cleaned out the spot where the quarters were, so. And I got that one ring there, too. Oh, Jordan got a ring, too. Just junkers, I'm pretty sure. This is a 16. I feel something down there, darn it. Let's see if I can get behind it. There we go. Uh, got it, whatever it is. I can see it. <laughs> oh, you gotta dig the trash to get to the good stuff, though. <laughs> Let's keep going. I need some water. Well, I found this square piece of metal. And I said, you know what? That looks gold. And I turned it over. And there's a design on there. Looks like a man and a woman. Let's scrape this. That could be gold. I think I got gold. It's real thin though. Uh, looks like Adam and Eve maybe. I don't know. Maybe you guys can tell. I need a better camera for that though. Uh, there's no marking on the back that I can tell with my bare eyes. But, that looks like gold. I'm gonna call it gold till we get home. I'm gonna take a guess. 14K. Well, I think I got a stainless steel ring, but I'm not sure. So I thought I'd turn the camera on. But anyways, I got a one target here. And there it is, one, between one, oh, no, it's two, three. But it, I don't even know if it's a ring, actually. I just see a little silver. Oh, no, it's not a ring. Oh, looks like a back to a watch. Yep, that's stainless steel. I knew it was stainless. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna keep going. Jordan just caught up to me. He's getting in my area now. This is my beach, buddy. He can't hear me, his headphones on. I think I just dug some Mexican money. Looks like some kind of pesos or something. I don't know though. It might not be. Huh. Yeah, I think it is. That's how their coins look. Anyways, I'm going to keep going. I'm getting tired. Alright, we are at home now. And, uh, well, that was a pretty fun hunt. It was at night. I couldn't really show you any scenery or anything, but other than that, it was, a. Uh, well, it was kind of like uh, I was getting targets, but there wasn't a lot of targets, but there was a nice little break in between targets. And uh, here's what we got. Got 10, 11, 12 pennies. One, only one nickel. Uh, three dimes. Uh, one, two, three, 350 and quarters. Wait a minute. Why do I always mess up counting my quarters? <laughs> One, two, three, four, twenty-five. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> uh, we got some sunglasses, and we found these right when we got down there. Jordan actually eyeballed them. I think the other detector down there probably found these, or they may have just washed up. I don't know. But the other guy that was down there, he did get a nice gold ring. It's kind of thin, but. It was a nice one. My sunglass rack is getting so full. I don't know where to stick this one. <laughs> See if I can find a spot. Mm. Sorry about this. Uh, there we go. <laughs> Fix it later. 
and we also got a Mexican coin. These are always fun to find. I have a big jar of random coins that I find, tokens and that kind of stuff. I'll throw that in there. That's 10 pesos. And then we got this ring, little blue thing in there. And uh, I was really happy when I found that because I wasn't thinking I was going to find a ring. And I did. <laughs> Not much of a ring. I don't think I showed this one on camera. It's a little flower. It's off a piece of jewelry. Not sure what it's off of, but it is off a piece of jewelry. Then we got these little bits and pieces of stuff. And two pieces of trash. That's all the trash I got on uh, this. That's not bad. Oh yeah, this little pieces are trash too. Um, some people have been asking about my detector. It is an Equinox, a Mind Lab Equinox 600. Uh, I've had it for probably almost a year now, I think. I don't know. But I, I put a lot of use into this detector. And uh, it is kind of not lasting. Uh, this bottom part here is, well, I can't show you with one hand. <laughs> but I'll try. So right here at the connector, uh, this bottom shaft here, it actually turns like a lot, <laughs> like loose and I've tightened, you can't tighten it down anymore. And uh, so that's one of the bad things about it. And then the charging, like right now I'm trying to charge it cause I want to go again tonight. I don't need to charge it, but it's, it's like one of those magnet connectors and they, they actually look rusty. Maybe I should try cleaning them. Anyways, it's really hard to get it to charge now. And that's about the only two things that have gone wrong with it. Other than that, this is a really good detector. And the bottom part, they do sell a replacement part for it. I can't afford it right now, obviously. Um, and this part, I, it might just be need, needing clean. Maybe I can sand it down or something. Uh, but like I said, I use this thing a lot. And then there's also a better coil you can get. It's a 15 inch coil and I'd like to get one, but again, I can't afford it. Um, so yeah, that's it. That's all I wanted to say about that. There's probably more. Uh, if I would get another one again, yes, I would. Definitely. It's a good detector. But on the other hand, I would like to try some other detectors out there. Um, I'd like to have like a little arsenal of them. <laughs> uh, but I'm pretty sure this is uh, probably the best for now for me. So I'm going to stick with this one. I'll probably just repair it. I bring tape with me every time in case this blows out completely. I can tape it back up. Um, and is there anything else I need to say? Nope. Oh yeah, Jordan got a ring, and the other guy got a gold ring. Now it's really weird, you, weird when you pull up to the beach, and you go right down to the beach that you're going to hunt at 1 o'clock in the morning, and there's somebody down there, metal detecting. That's kind of weird, and he was like right where I was going to go. But um, he's a cool guy, I like him. And uh, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to end it there. And um, hopefully tonight we'll get some gold. I don't know. I'm pretty sore. I might get it tomorrow night. All right. See you guys. I almost forgot this thing. Uh, when I was out there, it really looked gold. When I got home and saw it in the sunlight, not so much. <laughs> um, yeah, I tested it. It's not gold, but it's a pretty cool little, it's thin, look, I can't imagine what that would go to, it probably was stuck in something or something, I don't know, anyways, not gold, I don't know if you guys can see the, the picture on there, pretty cool little picture though, 
anyways I forgot to show it because I had it in my room because I was testing it and anyways there it is I'll see you guys in the next one again <laughs>